when I'm in the forest, I, I pray and I thank the forest for what it has given me in my life. And I take a personal responsibility to educate people about the forest as well as play an active role in preserving it. Stanley Park, the village of Kwai Kwai, is literally a gathering place for our Indigenous peoples and has existed for thousands of years. When we introduce people to Stanley Park and we share the, the rich, long history, we also get to share how we relate to the forest. And, and I think what we achieve is we allow people to look at the forest in a new way. To grow up here in this region as an Indigenous person, we're taught that we are a part of the land and the land is a part of us and that the land is sacred, um, water is life. The coastline of the Salish Sea is one of the most diverse areas on the planet. Another thing that's special about the Salish Sea is how close we are to some of the, the biggest human centers in the province and that interaction between humans and, and the ocean has been going on for thousands of years in this area, which makes it really rich culturally as well. The city has a major influence on what's happening in the ocean. And the ocean has a tremendous influence on us. It really gives us a sense of place, a sense of identity as Vancouverites and British Columbians. You don't have to go very far before you're in places that feel very remote and very wild, even though you're close, close to the city here. So even just around the corner from Vancouver, you might see whales or dolphins or schools of fish jumping at the surface, um, and you're really on the verge of the wilderness.